Hi everyone! As soon as I did my last Gachapon video, I found so many more amazing Gachapon and I just had to show you them. So this has turned into a bit of a series and you can find all the others on my channel. If you haven't seen them, this is my roundup of cute, funny and strange Gachapon from Japan. Gachapon are the toys and figures you get from the capsule machines. They're usually only about two or three hundred yen and they're often related to anime, but I think the most interesting ones are the strange and unusual series. Some of them are so random. So here we go and tell me what you think. I always try and reply to your comments, so tell me which one you would choose. First up, Tornado Slime. It's a spinning top filled with slime. The world definitely needs a combination of those two things. You can also get slime with jellyfish inside and it lights up. Tapioca Bubble Tea Slime. It looks a bit like frog spawn. Bucket Face Slimy. You push the slime into the bucket and it comes out the mouth and the eyes too, I guess. There's actually loads of slime gachapon. I'm gonna stop there, but if slime's your thing, there's plenty more to choose from. Now, do you remember the abandoned theme park rides from my last Gachapon video? They were right at the end. It turns out there's whole series of abandoned and scrap items. I never knew this was a trend. I actually can't believe how many there are. There's scrap cars, you can build them into a tower, more scrap cars, and even more scrap cars. This one's been crushed. Scrap supercars, waste heavy equipment, old trucks and diggers, there's scrap tanks, Scrap trains. This one's a Shinkansen bullet train. Some of them have plants growing through them. And you can pile them up to make a mini scrap heap on your desk. Who wouldn't want that? And finally, scrap space rockets and satellites. This is why SpaceX are making reusable rockets. Ancient Egyptian gods in kawaii style and a ghost. Now I don't know much about this, but it seems to be a character in Japan called Majed. Now the main character may look like someone in a cheap ghost costume with a sheet over their head, but it's actually a real ancient Egyptian god and it looks just like him. I am liking the combination of kawaii with ancient Egypt. You see a lot of the same sorts of things sometimes in kawaii and this is something really different. I think they go together really well. And if you like cute things, have a look at my designs on cakeswithfaces.co.uk. These are my dresses. There's Starry Night, that's the one I'm wearing today. It's got cake themed star constellations. There's cute explosion. I love wearing this one, it's so colorful. And my tattoos dress with cat tattoos. And my magical Kyoto tunics with a pattern inspired by Japan. There's also t-shirts, hoodies, and lots of other things as well. Back to the gachapon. Lapel mics, so you can pretend you're a TV presenter. Wrestlers in bridge position. You can stack them to make a tower of wrestlers. And it doesn't matter if you get duplicates, you can just add them to your tower. I got these stacking figures from Akihabara. They're from a certain magical index. I just love the looks on their faces. Eggs that are like transformers. They turn into animals and dinosaurs. And the most egg-shaped giraffe you've ever seen. Squishy pizza slices. Mochi mochi pizza squeeze. Collect them all to make a whole pizza. There's loads of Gachapon squishies. I'll just show you this one more. Squishy noodles in their packets. There's soba, ramen, udon, mochi mochi. Light up drinks mugs. It says parody mug light. They're tiny drinks and they're also torches. But I think the funniest thing about these is they're not the official brands. Boss Coffee is a type of coffee in a can you can get from vending machines in Japan. But here, it's not Boss Coffee, it's Bus Coffee. On this one, the drink Pokari Sweat is Porari Sweat. And this beer isn't Asahi, it's Usagi, which means rabbit. There's also sweets and snacks as torches, and they look just like the real thing. This one is one of my favorite Japanese snacks, Takenoko no Sato. They're little biscuits covered in chocolate. They're a bit like Kunoko no Yama if you've ever had them. Thomas the Tank Engine being dangled by a crane. This does seem a bit risky for Thomas. And what is the expression on the crane's face? I think it seems really strange to see Thomas the Tank Engine things in Japan. To me, it seems like the most British thing, but it's actually quite popular. And they have Thunderbirds too. Last one, Steam Planet. Steampunk animals, they look pretty cool. And look at the mechanical ladybird. So there will be more Gachapon on the way in a couple of weeks. So subscribe if you wanna see that. And I'm always posting things about Japan on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram. I'm Cakes With Faces on all of them. So I'll see you soon. Bye bye.